Hello everyone, welcome back to Crypto Gains for another video. In this video, I thought I would talk to you about Moonbeam because on the 11th, I'm a bit delayed on this one, a couple of weeks, no, about a week back, week and a half, they launched their second token called Glemmer, G-L-M-R, I think I'm saying that right. And I want to discuss, you know, what, is it a good thing, is it a bad thing? Because it's this project has been seriously, like, like, anticipated for the longest of times what is moonbeam is it a good investment if it sounds interesting to you please drop that like give me a subscribe if you're new watching i want to break down the stake inside of things and all sorts because you can stake on this as well uh before i go any further i need to let you know i am not a financial advisor these are my own personal opinions on the market so please do your further research before you invest your money so the future of multi chain uh, multi chain is here it says expand to new chains powered by moonbeam an ethereum compatible smart contract parachain on polkadot cool the easiest path to multi chains uh, minimal configuration changes tools you already use okay oh, it has little sub things under it <laughs> no no need to rewrite the, uh, or reconfigure your smart contracts they all work right away cool uh, use ethereum based tools uh, you love like metamask remix hard hat i don't know what that ha 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 What's hard hat? I've not heard of that. Uh, waffle. <coughs> Listen, the last time I heard of a waffle was when I was eating it, you know, and some trifle. And that's truffle. There are tools that you can use. So, and I noticed that when I connected to their app, because, you know, you can click launch app, automatically it, it loads the moonbeam straight into my MetaMask, which is cool. And I like that because a lot of sites are doing it. You know, on the Harmony chain, you've got Unite Finance where you just click it. Boom, done it, adds you to the MetaMask because you don't have to go looking for the information and type it in. It's all long. We want to just click your site, bang, on, done. Uh, so that's a good look. Uh, support our Solidity uh, Vi Viper and anything that complies to EVM uh, byte code. So they're making it easier for or, or familiar for people that use EVMs. Like an EVM is like an um, emulator ethereum emulator that's what it basically is is that right an ethereum emulator Vir virtual machine there you go yeah something like that uh pre-built integrations so mo uh, built integrations for assets like dot and erc 20s uh tokens uh and inf infrastructure services like Chainlink and the graph so this is looking to seriously be multi-chain really you know do a lot with different chains at ease uh, a fully ethereum compatible environment on polka dot Cool. Uh, it's, it is interesting. I've been saying this for the longest time. Like a lot of these projects that you see, like the Polka Dot Solana, so whoever they are, um, they're all trying to make sure they're compatible with Ethereum. Why? Maybe because they see how much chunk of the market share Ethereum has. I don't know. Like, but you know, Ethereum seriously is everything's trying to make sure they are adapting into Ethereum. Maybe because there's a lot of people that have been building on Ethereum and you know, if someone wants to come off and try something easier, cheaper, lower in fees, maybe that makes it easier for them to bridge across and, you know, come across. Um, so grow your project with a multi-chain. Moonbeam helps projects expand their reach to new users and markets with a multi-chain approach. Explain it, because people are still, you know, <laughs> well, I'll explain it. Uh, address segments of your, mar of your market that are out of reach on Ethereum due to the gas prices. Well, that was what I was just saying, you know, people don't want to keep paying higher gas prices, to, so they may bridge across to another chain, so, you know, it'd be cheaper for them. Rich pool of assets. Gain immediate access to DOT, KSM, native Polkadot assets like Glimmer and AUSD. I don't know what that is, but I'm guessing it's on the Polkadot chain because it's all the same, like, all stable coins in it, but this one's AUSD. Because you know, I would have thought that was Australian US dollar. I don't know, you tell me. Plus, <laughs> other bridged assets such as Bitcoin and Ethereum. Cool. It's basically just trying to say to you that it's going to be a really easy way to bridge stuff. Look at the partnerships. Now, again, I was hype about this because, you know, it's got Razor, <laughs> wherever Razor is. Because, you know, I've been invested into Razor because uh, I think that's a great oracle that's going to seriously set this up for greatness. I can't see Razor anymore. There it is, Razor, right here. <laughs> uh, you can't see it, my head's in the way. There you go, right here, Razor. Uh, they got good partnerships. Um, let's just click launch because if you want to stake this one, when you click launch, it takes you to here. It, you can stake on the Moon Beam because you got remember Moon River and Moon Beam are two different blockchains. I think Moon River is, oh, is it KSM? I don't know. It's it's another chain. I can't remember which one it is. 
but it's another chain. And this one, Moonbeam, is the polka dot chain. And these are the coins that I was interested in having. I don't know why. Um, but I don't know. I think it's going to do well, whichever one you have. I'm more, I, I don't know. I gravitate more towards the Glimmer token rather than the Moon River token. Okay? So you've got M-O-V-R, Moon River, and G-L-M-R, which is Glimmer, on two different chains. Power chain. Cool. I get it. Um, what kind of prices can you see this hit and stuff? I, I'm going to get through that in a second. But you can stake your Glimmer tokens, but you need a minimum of 50 coins. You see it down here, like, the minimum. As my mom, as my, you need the minimum of 50. What about it, mommy? What do you mean about it? Well, what do you mean, mommy? You need the minimum of 50. Okay, mommy. <laughs> Just, anyway, uh, you need the minimum of 50. And how much is 50 gonna cost you? I've got Glimmer token right here. It's up 12%. Again, people are hype. Uh, 50. 50 coins is you look at, it's gonna set you back 277 quid. Can you afford that? If you can call, you know, because that's what you need as a minimum. What would a thousand pounds give you? A uh, thousand pounds would give you 180 coins. Is that good? I don't know. You decide. This has a total of, uh, it says total supply here, one billion. The fact that this is sitting on five quid, this had an insane pump. You best believe, because it was sitting on like 15 quid a while ago, remember? Yeah, right back here, sitting up at like 15 quid. £14.37, <laughs> okay, well, 14 quid. it was higher, and it had a massive drop, you know, sell-off, people, you know, the people that get in early, they pre-sell, they sell off, and right down here, you saw a dip, you know, what we've been experiencing, down to like four quid, well, five quid, five pounds, because, you know, people in the US are like, what's quid? It's like a buck, <laughs> buck, buck, F five buck, like five, five pound, five quid, um, New UK people, they know what I mean, five quid. Uh, so yeah, you know, this is a, a, it looks like a good price. How high can it go? Well, look at the market cap. The market cap right here says 432 million. You want to have a realistic market cap when you, you know, when you start Xing this, because if it goes above Bitcoin's market cap, then you, you know, what's Moonbeam doing that, that makes, makes it want to be bigger than Bitcoin? I don't know. I'm just saying it's got to be below it. Times it by, what, a 10x? That is very conservative, a very realistic price figure. You're call, I'm, I'm calling a 4.3 billion market cap. It's going to go higher than that. Uh, but this is an easy 10x on your money. That's all I'm saying. If you had 10 grand, that's an easy 100 grand right there. That, that's what I'm saying. If you had 1,000 pounds, it's an easy 10 grand. If, if you had 100 quid, that's an easy 1,000 pounds to make. 200 quid? Anyway, you know what I mean. Uh, so this is why I think it could be a good buy. Because there's not often you come across projects that is an easy 10x. And for me, this is an easy 10x. I'm going to bring another video on Moonbeam when you see it sitting on about 54 quid, 55 quid. Because look, times 10, 54, oh, shimmy a decimal four, back, 55, you can't see it there, look, 55 quid. That's the price you're going to be seeing it sitting on. And that is a very realistic price. I'm not going over the top. I'm not calling tens of billions. I'm calling 4.3 billion for Moonbeam. Um, what else has been going on? I grabbed up their medium page. They've also got a how to stake. So, you know, if you want to look into how to stake, click on their medium page. They have a full breakdown on that. It shows you how to do it. Um, but yeah, this is a big project. Don't underestimate Moonbeam. What else has been going on? So, Moonbeam crowd loan rewards. Uh, the Moonbeam Foundation is delighted to announce that a series of motions have passed governance for the initial distribution of crowd loaning. I've not heard of that. I'm not going to read it now. I'm just curious to see what's been going on. Moonbeam completes the launch process is now live on Poker.Call. How to claim Moonbeam crowd loan rewards. Um, how to connect your metamask. It's just talking about how to do this and how to do that. Uh, but yeah, these are the things you want to check out. Do you guys have a Twitter? Do you have a Twitter? <laughs> Let me just see the Twitter. Um, I want to see how big the, the following is, you know, stuff like that. Because that kind of shows you how uh, big of a project uh, something can be. Like I said, this hasn't been out long either. What? 200,000! This hasn't even been out long! And you're sitting on 200,000! I gotta say it like that, because if I just say like 200,000, hmm, it doesn't sound right. 200,000! There's a lot of people paying attention to Moonbeam. Are you paying attention? Because I am. I'm, I'm, I'm looking at it. I'm telling you. Patrons, you, you might see a buy alert soon, you know, because <laughs> I might, might need to be staking. One thing I will say about the staking, though, it doesn't show how much you earn. How much percentage are you earning in yield? Can someone please drop the comments down below if you're doing it? Let me know. Because I want to know how much you earn. 
because you don't show it. Is it 5%, 10%, 100%? I don't know. You tell me. Uh, just It'd be good to know. Let's have a look what's going over here. So Moon, Moonbeam, this is 11 hours ago. Moonbeam new, now support. hold on. The graph now supports Moonbeam bringing indexing and querying to developers in the broader Polkadot ecosystem. So they did a partnership with uh, the graph. Good look. Look, these guys are partnering up. Uh, partnering up. Who, are they, who else are they partnered up with? What does it say here? Now supports Transact. Transac, ain't that ain't Transac uh, that place where you can onboard fiat, where you can pay for stuff in fiat money, like you can buy British pounds and US dollars. I think that's what Transac is, uh, and it's a good look if it is Transac. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I'm saying I'm sure Transac. I need to click on Transac real quick because I'm sure Transac has um, an onboarding fiat. Where you can just buy with British pounds, I'm sure. Let me just, I got, look, I'm going off topic real quick. I just got to see this real quick because they're part, yeah, they're partnering with Transac. So you could probably buy Moonbeam with British pounds or dollars, super simple with your card. I like that. And this is good. This I've been looking at Transac for a while because, you know, if you're looking to make a website and you want to start accepting crypto payments in fiat, maybe use Transac. So, you know, that, that's a good look. That's a good look. I like that. Let me come back. I like you, Transac. I'm going to look into you more, Transac. <laughs> Transac. <laughs> Just look into it. Uh, what else has uh, Moonbeam been doing? What's this here? There's a, uh, uh, they always do like a uh, visit Moonbeam docs. Moonbeam users can directly view the source code. Okay, they're just being transparent. Uh, what's this, a bridge? So they're, they're setting up bridges and whatnots. I think the project's going to be big. They've already done a million transactions. This, uh, guys, you need to understand. Is that for Glimmer? Or is that just in, in total? What? The Glimmer token. Like I said, it hasn't been out long. What, the 11th of Jan? Something like it hasn't been out long, guys. And it's already done a million transactions. People are seriously using this product or project. Uh, SubDAO. So what's SubDAO? We'll bring DAO capabilities to Moon River slash Moonbeam. Cool. Uh, guys, I'm going to bring more on this. I, do, something, I, don't, I don't know what it is. Something about Moonbeam. Don't know what it is, but something wee piggy <laughs> meet the wee piggy team uh, there's something about moonbeam that i like and i think it's gonna you know i mean what would you class this as a big cap gem right now low mid i think it's a mid cap because 400 million is a mid-sized cap uh, and is that correct let me just quickly go on to coin market cap because you know sometimes coin gecko coin mark they show different things let me just see uh glim uh would you just do moonbeam moonbeam because uh, you've got a Glimmer token. It comes up right away with Glimmer. £5 a piece. Yeah, £430 million market cap. This is a mid-sized cap. Moonbeam could sit up in the top 10, guys. I don't know when, but if it did, you know, what kind of market cap are we calling in the top 10? Like, Dogecoin right now is £13 billion. If it goes there, my God, you're talking 100... No, what are you talking? Well, 10x is 4.3. 4, 8, 12. You're talking like... 30x gains you know your 150 quid 170 quid price something like that 150 about 150 quid <laughs> something like 55 110 150 about 160 quid something like that for moonbeam if it does a 30x so uh yeah i just thought i'd share this with you i like the project I'm going to bring more on it. Guys, I'm going to leave it here. If this was helpful to you in some shape or form, I don't know, was it? Please let me know. Drop that like. Give me a subscribe if you're new watching. If you want to become a patron, I've got seven tiers. Take your pick. Let me go up. Look, see, 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 see. See the different tiers? I recommend going for my C, uh, no, exclusive VIP partner tier, this one here. This will unlock all my posts you can see when I buy, when I sell, when I stake, when I IDO. If you want a little bit more, go for my CEO tier. That's this one here. It gives you my super alerts. You will get access to my VIP Telegram group where I talk to you way before I buy, way before I sell, way before I do anything. It's all in there first. Uh, check it out because there's big money talking about big projects. Projects that you don't see on YouTube because they're just too greedy buying it up. <laughs> and then I get... <coughs> I'm coughing and then I look at my phone I'm like oh I better buy that too and then I'm rushing trying to put in my ledger and all sorts and just buy it and then I do a video on it <laughs> and then you see it five weeks later <laughs> so check it out if you want to get in early on these things trust me they're, they're not it's not a joke uh, it might be for you guys thanks for watching
and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Cheers.